Jamisha of Stylist with me and today I have a hair review for you guys this hair I bought from Amazon actually so Amazon two-day shipping this hair is from a company called Sinosha hair um I bought I'm gonna throw a little clip off to the side somewhere in here it might be over here over there um, I bought their 14, 16, and 18 inch bundle with a 12 inch closure and the texture is deep wave. So all in all, I think I ended up paying like around $98, I believe, which, you know, you, you think you're, that's kind of skeptical for paying for bundles at such a cheap price. But honestly, like this hair feels so good. Like this hair is so soft. Y'all, people have been walking around petting me like I'm a dog gone chill pet because this hair is so soft i'm amazed um okay let's get into this video about all this hair here so the hair length um of course curly hair is gonna come shorter than what it is so i shampooed the hair i conditioned the hair um before i even sewed it on to my wig cap and so this is the length of the hair now so it's like past my bra I'm only 5'3 so this is the hair length um so you know of course it comes tight and compact and it's loosened like it's it's really pretty loosened to me um the bundles I, if y'all wonder why I'm looking after the side child I got notes of points that I want to hit cuz I just go off on a tangent so the bundles they were pretty decent um the wefts were pretty decent the only thing is they feel short like the eight you know when you go up higher in length um the wefts become shorter and it's not like i ordered a 22 inch i ordered a 18 inch is my highest inch so at the 18 felt a little short to me um even the 16 and the 14 felt a little short to me but what is the dog on here? Okay, so this is all that I have left over. This is it. And we're going to do um, a test to see if this really is human hair at the end. So another thing about this hair, I was looking through the bundles. You know how you want to feel through to see filler hairs, to see if it's like orange, red. I'm going to insert a clip of what I found, and I found like a pink red pink thread and it was like a few orange hairs in there and i was like mm, like are these filler hairs because y'all this hair is so soft it's so soft you know how you feeling on a cat like this feel like cat hair bruh um <laughs> it's soft like it's really soft and then the tangling uh, yeah like that but honestly if you wet this hair like you would not have this problem i think it's because it's dry and then it's wet it's like um curly hair so i don't have too much problem like not even in the nape like it's not bad you know I, and i've been wearing this wig for two days now now the only thing is hot it's hot in alabama so i was feeling like this hair was like this hair was growing <laughs> It was growing and it was just getting puffy and puffy. But if you're a person that loves natural hair and you like the puffiness, me personally, I like the puffiness. I like the frizz. I embrace it. It doesn't bother me. But for someone who doesn't like that, you might want to tame this hair down. Now, I haven't applied any products to this hair besides um, the shampoo and conditioner that I use. That's from Tresemme for curly hair. And I just been using water and Nairobi foam. So, uh, I haven't really developed a night routine for this hair. I'm like, tonight I'm going to twist it up. But I haven't developed a night routine for this hair. Because you have to upkeep curly hair, correct? Yes, correct. Uh, the ends. This is what the ends look like. 
not too bad but I don't know like you need to get some keep them moisturized you know like keep them looking nice but oh all in all it's not that bad now we're gonna do a hair test to test and see if this hair is really human hair so they say me this human hair is gonna like smoke up and turn to ash and then if it's not this this is what I mean like I can see it like y'all probably can't see it but I don't know if it's just a light bouncing off this but that's okay I'm scared I'm scared I said oh lord Jesus it's a fire Smells like burnt hair. That smells burnt. Okay, so I got the little crunchy, the little ashiness, the little crunchiness, ness, So y'all got y'all answer. That's human hair. This is human hair. Oh my gosh, yeah, I can't believe I just burnt that. Now, nah. what we gonna do? We finna do a freaking water test. We're gonna no. We're not gonna do the water test. We're gonna flat iron this hair, and then we're gonna do the water test to see if these curls will revert back. <laughs> Ooh, All right. So I'm back, Lord. It smells burnt as heck in here. In my room, my room is small, so it smells burnt, toasty. Now, I didn't straighten this hair all that good, but that's good enough for demonstration purposes. So, I got my little water bottle, and then we're going to mist this hair. This is fun. Okay. We're going to see if this reverts. Now, this is like the extremely straight part. So, we're going to see. Let's see if I scrunch it. Would it increase a curl? I see it coming back. One. Slowly. Of course. Okay. Oh, God. Y'all. It looked like this thing don't want to come back. Six and a half hours later. Okay. A curl is forming. Curls are forming. It took a little second. Okay. So the curls kinda do come back, but they taking ten thousand years, child. So if you gon um if you gon flat iron this hair just know that it's gonna take a little second to come back okay so they came back and even on their um description on amazon they're like if you're gonna okay all right we're in the game even on it the, they're in their description on amazon they say do not um flat iron the hair often which is you know a given you keep flat on your hair you're gonna get heat damage child. it's not it's not gonna come back that's it's not rocket science um so, my final thoughts on this hair. This is just my two-day. This is like an initial review for this hair. So, all in all, I would say if you are on a budget, on a hundred dollars, and I think right now it's like ninety dollars um, on Amazon. Cause a girl asked me today while I was at work where I got this hair from. So, um, this is what the closure looks like. I don't have a stocking cap on right now. Yeah, y'all, I like it. I like. I like. I like. 
and I'm just gonna insert pictures of me and clips of me spritzing my hair and um combing my hair so yeah that's all I have to say about this hair from Sonosha hair um off Amazon of course so please like share comment subscribe all that good stuff and I'll see y'all in my next video bye oh y'all so I know um this channel is just not all about beauty it's gonna be about sewing stuff so if y'all watched my last video about me making a prom dress for my cousin I'm actually editing the other video I know don't kill me I'm editing the second part so where I can show y'all like her dress so stay tuned for that and I see y'all in another video. Bye. Bruh, so I done finished this wig, right? But y'all, it's like wild and unruly because I didn't brush it. And look, my cap is fitting so nice and this is the lace. I done plucked it some. But I don't know. I'm finna cut it with my eyebrow razor so I don't really want to look at this I want to look in my bathroom mirror oof sure. baby I should have put this on my mannequin head